first YouTube video and I'm so excited to be finally sharing with you my life journey as a wife, a mother, an interior decorator, a role model and someone who just wants to give back to the community. So um, yeah, I'm shooting from my kids bedroom and just in case you would like to take a tour with me on how I decorated their bedroom, make sure you look out for that video that I'll be uploading very soon. Um, as you all know, or in case you don't know, I have two gorgeous babies, Ethan and Gabriella. Ethan is five years old, Gabriella just made eight months about a week ago. And I thought to myself, this is a perfect timing and this is a perfect way for me to just share with you um, my journey on how I lost the baby weight and how I got back to my pre-body. Um, so, just before I get into my tips, I would like to say if you're pregnant right now and you are worrying about your baby weight and you're thinking, oh my god, am I, you know, am I going to lose this baby weight after I give birth, I will suggest to you to just first relax. Take it easy, focus on having a safe delivery, um, focus on giving birth to your baby and uh, enjoy your pregnancy and get to worry about the baby weight after you give birth. Uh, this video will always be online um, and you can always come back and refer to it. So um, yeah, my first tip will be for you to relax and think positive. And I say this because I'm a very positive person and this is why it's my first tip. I'm a very positive person, I'm very optimistic and I don't entertain negativity. I try my best to fill my head and my mind with positivity whenever I'm going through, you know, um, struggles or whenever I'm going through you know challenges in my life and uh, yeah it helped me very, it helped me so much during my pregnancy journey and it helped me so much you know when I was focusing on losing the baby weight and I believe it can help you also because you know during pregnancy and after childbirth we get to have all these slogans and all these questions in our head like oh am I gonna lose the baby weight oh I'm so fat Oh, I don't think I'm going to fit in my jeans again. I don't think I'm going to fit in my clothes again. You know, and we go on and on and on with all these worries. But um, I'm here to encourage you that you need to think positive. You need to put on a positive attitude and fill your head with uh, motivation and positivity. And make the mirror your best friend because it's only you who's going to inspire you in the end. So, uh, yeah, that's my first tip, the relax, think positive. And my second tip will be breastfeeding. Now, I know a lot of ladies use this technique um, or use breastfeeding as a way of losing weight. And I think it's a very terrific way um, of losing weight. I can testify to this, although I don't get to breastfeed my babies for a long period of time because my boobs just, you know, disappear but um yeah the few months that i do i do notice that a lot of weight you know is shedding off and um if you're really into breastfeeding kudos you know i really respect you guys uh, um, i would love to breastfeed for a long period of time but unfortunately i don't and uh yeah it, in the end my babies have you know been healthy you know they haven't had any health issues but yeah, breastfeeding is another way of losing weight and uh, yeah, I can testify to it. So yeah, breastfeeding. Um, my third tip will be working out, training, exercising and um, this is where the hard work comes in and uh, this is where you have to be really determined and focused uh, because um, a lot of you know, newly mothers they tend to think, you know, okay, since, you know, I'm a newly mother, you know, I, I still have a newborn, I can't really go to the gym. But what I did, I got a trainer to come home and uh, they used to train me three times in a week and for one hour. And I found it very helpful because I could still go and check on Gabriella and come back and continue with my training. So, yeah, you know, work out, you know, um, train, you know, get some drills, you know, some daily drills that you can do. You can look uh, at YouTube, you know, look out for videos, DVDs. But personally for me, I prefer working out with someone because it motivates me so and that's why I got a trainer. And um, 
Yeah, during most of pregnancy, I used to exercise, I used to swim, I used to take evening walks with my with my husband. So um, if you're pregnant right now, um, I would encourage you to you know start exercising, walking. It also helps you you know um, to lose weight faster after birth. Um, a month. After I gave birth, I weighed 62 kgs, and um, I started training. This is this, this is just when I started training. I had weighed 62 kgs, and a month later, I weighed 60 kgs. So I dropped uh, two kgs within just one month, and that means I dropped about 13 kgs within the two months uh, after I gave birth. So yeah, that's my third tip: working out, training, and exercising. Um, tip number four will be working on the stomach. You know, I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm really you know crazy about working on my stomach. And um, yeah, who, who wouldn't be you know after having a baby? So um, the first two weeks after I gave birth, I used what I call the box method, and it's where you just get a box like a cardboard box and just put it on the front part of your stomach and just tie a piece of cloth or a garter to just help you you know to just help you reduce the stomach on those first few days and um i did this a day after i was discharged from the hospital and i did it for two weeks gradually just tightening it up and why i use the box method is because you know when we use a piece of cloth or a less you you know the um the, the stomach still falls over or if, if you're using a gutter like you also notice that the stomach still falls, falls over so the box just helps you know um, you to have a, you know, a straight posture and for those first few days for it to be straight and you just continue gradually tightening it as you know as, as uh, the days go by and um, yeah I, I hope to be uploading a video about this to show you how to use the box method so you know look out for that video and um, after a month when I started you know working out I got myself a waist trainer and whoo, look at what it did you know like waist trainers are you know the best and I wore this for six to eight hours in a day and in the evening I just you know let you know I, I I, 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 you know, let myself loose and just, you know, um, got to relax. So yeah, I wore it six to eight hours in a day. Um, yeah, uh, what else? Um, uh, my tip number five will be eat for one and drink for two. Um, this means that, you know, uh, Ladies, we don't have to eat for three after giving birth. And I'm not saying for you to starve yourself, no, eat healthy. But what I'm trying to say is that uh, drink a lot of fluids. Uh, personally, myself, I used to take a cup of Ovaltine every two hours and a lot of water, three to four liters in a day. And while I was breastfeeding, I used to get so thirsty, so I used to drink a lot of water and a lot of fresh juices. You know, I was so addicted to fresh juices during my pregnancy, and afterwards, I, I drank a lot of you know fresh juices. So yeah, eat for one, drink for two, and tip number six will be for you to get enough rest and sleep yes yeah, so uh when when gabriella used to sleep i also use it as an opportunity for myself to sleep and just rest and i know a lot of ladies who don't have helpers around during those first you know few months or um who are used to being um or being alone or not having anyone to help around usually use this opportunity to just walk around the house you know do chores and 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 you know uh, I really adore them, <laughs> but personally myself, once Gabriella sleeps, um, I used to use it as an opportunity for myself to sleep because I have a nanny and you know she used to take care of all the cleaning and the house chores. So uh, yeah, I used to get enough uh, a lot of sleep and enough rest. And Gabriela was the type of, yeah, in the night, I'm awake, during the day, I'm awake. So whichever opportunity I got, I was like, poof, yeah, I'm, I'm, a, <laughs> I'm sleeping. Like, do not disturb me. I'm also sleeping. I'm getting enough rest. Because the night shifts, we all know, they can get really, really crazy. Um, 
my seventh tip and my last tip is to look good and feel good. We all know that when you look good, you're gonna feel good about yourself. Um, there's no excuse for you for not, you know, looking good and taking care of yourself after, you know, childbirth. Um, motherhood should be um, a very amazing experience and should not let you just lean back and say oh now i'm old now you know i have kids i don't have to take care of myself and you know blah 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 you know how it all goes but myself i strive to look good not for not for really others but also for myself you know it helps me build myself it helps me feel confident and yeah i strive to look good and uh, what i used to do is get uh, someone uh, a, a salon lady or someone to come into the house and just make my hair make my nails and you know just you know to feel like i'm me again um, so yeah, those are my favorite tips. Um, I don't think I've left anything out, but just in case you would like to share with me a few more tips on how you got to lose the baby weight, please do. I really appreciate that. And um, just in case you would like to find out on how uh, to buy a waist trainer or where to buy a waist trainer or to get a trainer to come home um, please do uh, send me an email on my email address in the description box and I'll get back to you I hope you'll find uh, you know these tips helpful and uh, yeah um, what can I say um, enjoy yourself uh, be happy smile you know you just went through the best ordeal a woman can ever go through and uh, you know giving birth and carrying you know uh, carrying another uh, a person and another soul in you and you know just giving birth to life and um you don't really have to beat yourself around you know losing the baby weight the more you relax the more you, uh, you think positive the more you just you know encourage yourself and the more you you know keep those thumbs up and keep that energy up you will definitely lose the baby weight. So thanks for watching and um, I'll see you on my next video. Bye.